guys, so I recently had a photo shoot and this is the makeup that I wore in the shoot. And I absolutely loved how the photos turned out. So if you're interested in seeing the makeup look, let me know. Um, and don't forget there is a giveaway at the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. So I'm just putting my Yes to Cucumbers eye gel on the bottom just to, I don't know, give some moisture to my eyes. And I'm using the MAC Studio um, Tech Foundation. And I love this foundation for entertainment purposes. So if you're going on a photo shoot or to a show or being interviewed, I think this is great because with lights, it makes your skin look really, really nice as you'll be able to see at the end of the video. I don't recommend it for everyday wear though because it is very harsh. So I'm using a Mirabella foundation brush which I absolutely love, it's one of my favorite foundation brushes. And then I'm using MAC Paint Pot in Vintage Selection and I'm applying it all over my lids as a base and I'm using a BH Cosmetics eyeshadow brush but you can use whatever eyeshadow brush you want and that really helps just kind of create a base. So I'm taking a brown eyeliner and drawing in a fake crease and this is kind of my trick you guys for making my eyes look big when they're not. And then I'm taking the Milani brow kit and I absolutely love this kit. This is like a must have because I use it for eyeshadow colors. So I'm using the brown color um, and using windshield wiper motions and just kind of blending that brown line into my eye so it looks a little bit like a crease. Don't worry, that's not the final product. It's okay. We're, we're gonna survive, yeah. Um, and then I'm taking this like skin colored highlight, highlight pen thing, and not highlight pen thing, liner, and lining the water line um, to give my eyes a little bit of brightness. I like to put it really close to the inside of my eyes. I know you're not supposed to do that, but Hey, I am a rule breaker. Yep. Rule breaker. Okay. So then I'm taking um, MAC Pearl. Uh, what do you call it? MAC Cream Color Base in Pearl. And I'm just applying it where you see now, like on the cheekbones and then the eyebrows, all that. And I just love how it gives me that dewy shimmer. And then I'm just putting a layer of mascara. This is the Rocket. It's okay, it's not my favorite, but you know, you make do with what you have. And then I'm taking um, Benefit Bad Gal and putting out my bottom lashes. I don't like using the Rocket on the bottom lashes because the brush is too large. Okay, so now I am putting on false lashes. And the lashes I'm using are by Red Cherry. I absolutely love those lashes because they fit Asian eyes really well, or my eyes really well, without cranking in the beginning or end. Um, and then I'm taking this highlighter under eye concealer by Revlon, and it's specifically for under eyes, and I'm just blending that in, and that just lifts my face a little bit up, especially for photos. It looks really nice. And then taking the Milani liquid liner, this is one of my favorite liners, and it just covers up the band and the lashes and it looks really nice. Then I'm taking MAC Paint Pot and Constructivist and using the Sigma um, flat top eyeliner brush and just lining the bottom of my lash line and that'll make it seem like my bottom lashes are longer. And then I'm taking just a little bit of an orange shade of shadow and just blending that in just to give me a little bit of pop. And then I'm taking a brown shadow from a Bobbi Brown eyeshadow and putting it in the crease. And then going over with a brown pencil just to give it a little bit of definition. So here I'm taking the Real Techniques eyeshadow brush and I actually really, really like it to contour. I'm taking a powder by Clinique and it's actually in a significantly darker color. And I'm taking the brush and putting it from kind of my eyebrows down and it just makes my nose look a little bit pointier which you could probably tell in the photos and then I'm taking this crown brush and blending that all in so that is the look for the face for the lips I'm using wet n wild lip 
pencil in Willow, and I love this pencil. Just gives you a very natural lip look. And then I just curl a little bit at the bottom of the hair in case the curlers didn't get it. Um, but I really like the effect the curlers make. It's the, the curls are much looser and they're more voluminous, which I like. But you can just touch it up with a hot iron. This is a Hot Tools curling iron in one and a half inches. And yeah, that is the look. Thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to subscribe and enter the giveaway and sign up for Perfect Beauty. Bye, loves. In making videos I realized my viewers had a lot of questions and I wanted to create a community for you guys to answer those questions to one another so I decided to create a beauty community on the internet and I'm inviting you guys to join on yourperfectbeauty.com so all you got to do is sign in and we have to sign in with the social network because that's how we make sure you're a real person um, so click accept we will not post anything on your behalf without your permission and then choose your birth year so you're on your profile now and you can change your photo, edit your profile, add new posts, and write product reviews. And so to introduce yourself, go onto the home page and see what all our other beauties are posting and writing about. You can embed your videos to get more viewers and get more uh, people to know about your channel. And also look at product reviews so you can type in different products. For example, I love these uh, facial cleansers and so I'm going to write a great review on them. And we just want to create a community where we have trusted reviews from users like you so you guys know what beauty products work and don't work. Here's a list of all of our beauty products. We have over 6,000 products on our site. And you can also see um, what other users are saying about different products and say hi on their wall. Very, very similar to Facebook. You can also look at your notifications on the top right and see what people are commenting or complimenting on. Again, very similar to Facebook. We consider ourselves kind of a Facebook for beauty. Um, here you can see people's posts and then respond to them. And we have a lot of beautiful girls here creating great content for us. And they can also search for different products. For example, type in Alme, and you, you can see kind of five beauties have a the product. So thank you guys so much, and please feel free to join our community. Beauty and I don't care what you say Ain't no boss perfume or makeup gonna make me that way She said I'm just gonna be me She said I'm a perfect beauty I hope to see you all in the perfect beauty form So, love you, bye!